to have plumbing. Um, I learned about this in like eighth grade, like learned about the Mesopotamia River or some shit. Um, it was like, if you don't have plumbing, um, you know, that feces or something, it's some, it, it, it creates more disease. It creates right. more disease. So, you know, I'm more than like willing to just like acknowledge the fact that we need both yeah. men and women to have a productive society. And this is obviously the case. Well, uh, but okay, I don't well, think that there's going to be in like any uh, asset uh, that would show that men are going to be better than women or men are going to be the necessary leaders or like more smart, more logical or less emotional. I think okay, by so, the denotation of like male plumbers, um, well, what have I just pointed at? Like the female social workers or the fact that, you know, we like females are like required to sustain the life of any man via the process of giving birth. Right. Um, but yeah. you know, let's, let's, let's clean this up a little bit. What point did I make, uh, in which you are attacking and what is your argument? Well, no, no, no. You said, you said, no, I just asked you to give me one and you, you, this is the one you said. So that's what I'm, you know, I'm, that's what I'm gonna talk about. Um, you said that, you know, that, uh, men, women don't need men. Okay. So, um, don't need men to lead them. Okay. Well, is that not, is that not taking a leadership role, providing the things that you need? I mean, do you think that like men need women to lead them? Okay. Is that okay? So can you, can you engage in what I just said? Um, yeah, I, I don't think that that's going to be like a leadership role. Correct? That's not a leadership role providing what is needed on a, mm -hmm. on a global scale. Right. And then also what would be implied by the statement, women don't need men to lead them would be like a necessity. Like, I think that like, it's going to be quite plausibly the case that women could be plumbers too. Um, yep. And like, are you yep. saying that like a plumber is going to be like, like the most, like, that's going to be like the standard of leadership? No, um, that, that is a part of it. Um, you know, leadership is a, is a very broad thing, but I'm not just saying plumbing. Okay? I'm just really uh, confused yeah, on your argument here. Okay. Well, okay. So let me, let me, let me just explain. Okay. So uh, I'm, I'm just going to start from square one. So food, you know, we need food. So, um, a lot of times how you get that food, a lot of farmers are predominantly male. A lot of people who clean this meat are predominantly male. A lot of people who gather this meat is predominantly male. A lot of people who put the stuff in the meat to keep it preserved, predominantly male. Okay. So mm -hmm. I feel like that's a leadership. I feel like that's a leadership um, position. Okay. Now water. Um, so, you know, you brought plumbing. Okay. So that, that can be, that could be a source of water. Um, you know, uh, I don't know if plumbing is getting the water to your house. Um, but I think, I don't know, um, you know, again, the water to your house, predominantly male, uh, purifying the water, predominantly male, um, you know, even plumbing, you know, making sure you're, you know, the, the, the waste jobs, you know, cleaning, you know, um, cleaning the poop from the water and you know, all that's predominantly male. Okay. So that's what I'm trying to say. That's a leadership position. And if we did not have that, um, I'm not saying that I'm not, you know, when I say, I'm not saying that all women are, you know, if, 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 if. You know, no women can do this. That's not what I'm saying. But, it, you know, to, to keep the world how we're doing right now, they need that. And they will not. Right, but I, I don't think that this shows that um, women, like, require male leadership at, at how all. How does that not show that? How does that not show that? Yeah, because, I, I mean, you're basically conflating, like, social conditioning and the result of that on society uh, to, like, necessary leadership of male, uh, right? Of males, right? Well, so, like, well, here, here's okay. how, I, I just let you talk, so I'm going to ask okay. you to, like, you know, s settle down just for oh, a second. Oh, my bad, I thought you were done, my bad, my bad. No, I'm no. not done, right? All right. So, like, here, here's, here's how I'm looking at it, right? So, like, the traditional gender norms are the man has to go out and provide and sustain the household while the woman stays home, cooks, cleans, and raises the children. Okay. And the result of this on society today is we're going to see a lot of men in the quote-unquote harder jobs, right? And I don't think that this is going to be caused because men are, like, it like, it like necessarily better at them, but all okay. because of that, like, uh, because of that societal indoctrination into the traditional way of thinking. Okay. And, like, a good example of this is going to be you know, over the course of the last hundred years or so, we have like seen the like the number of women in these respective fields, especially the STEM fields, on a constant incline, right? And they, they, this incline is okay. to, due to our society becoming more egalitarian, 
right? And like, okay. and if it is to do to our society just being more egalitarian and more accepting of all and their differences, then it will not be due to these intrinsic traits which men possess that women don't that cause them to be the necessary leaders. Um, but that's a good next question. So you do think that women require necessary male leadership? What biological traits do men possess that women do not that cause them to be the necessary leaders? Okay, well, so you just brought up. Okay, before uh, I want you to answer that question, uh, ask that question again uh because i'll definitely forget but you know you have brought up gender roles so and you're saying um you know you you said you know a lot you know i can i could barely even follow but you know i think i got the i kind of grasped it um you know so do you think that gender roles are um the result of patriarchy or do you think patriarchy is the uh result of gender roles oh yeah no gender roles are definitely the result of the patriarchy right well, I think that um, um, patriarchy um, is the um, result of gender roles because, you know, I mean, you um, can take that too. it. I mean, it's it's however you want to formulate it. Like, I think that patriarchy is the result of this barbaric train of thought within the man. Right. So I think men are more emotional and less logical than women. And that compared okay. with their physical strength has led to the patriarchy as we see it. Right. So this just this all has to do with this like barbaric domination of women that men have out of the out of like their physical strength, and that has led to like the social construction and the intricacies in which we observe in the world around us, right? Okay, well, uh, but yeah. you still just ignored my question. Like I asked well, you a okay. question and you just like completely ignored it. You didn't right, acknowledge well, it. You didn't touch on it whatsoever. Yeah. What, was your what traits do men possess that women do not possess that cause the men to be the necessary leaders? Oh well, yeah. I told you to ask me that again, if I'm not mistaken. And I was gonna, I was gonna, I, I told you that I was gonna ask about gender roles, and I told you to ask that question again. Um, so, um, you know, because you didn't even give me a chance to engage what you said before. So, like, you know, I'm just kind of on like a defensive, you know, what's the name? You're just kind of just throwing these questions at me when I ask the question. You know, you're not really, you know, trying to engage, or you just go completely around it. I but, just answered um, your question. But okay, so um, what? Okay, so um, men, um, you know, you just said that we're not anything. So I, I, according to you, nothing, you know, we're not better at anything. You know, according to you, women are better that and everything than us. Hold up. No, my, my simple assertion is that women don't require necessary male leadership. Well, you said, well, you said that, um, that we're, we're more emotional than women. We're more, or women are more logical and, you know, you right. know so according to you. Yeah, I, I do hold work. that. I do hold that position. I think men are more emotional than women, and I think women are more logical than men. Do you well, want to yeah. challenge that at all? Well, um, well, according to you, you know, because you asked me a question, you know what? So according to you, and then you said that, you know, the only thing that you really said that according men According to me? Um, no, what's your contention with that? What's your pushback? Um, with the, the logical and all that? Yeah. Um... I just don't, I don't, I don't see that. I don't, I don't, I don't see that. I don't believe that. Okay. Well, I think you should believe it because if you actually look at like the world around you, the external okay. world, it becomes evidently clear. Jay, man, who commits vast majority of all violent crimes, men or women? Um, men, for sure. Probably. Um, who performs better in academics? Um, uh, say, I don't know. Yeah, women. I don't know. Who graduates from school on all levels more? Um, uh, I don't know. Yeah. Sure. Women, well, women, okay. right? Uh, okay. Who um, who gets in more car crashes, men or women? Um, I would say men. Men, right? Uh, yeah. Who drunk? Who who commits like reckless activities such as drunk driving or reckless driving or gambling more, men or women? Uh, I would say men. Men. Who uh, unalives themselves more, men or women? Uh, I would say men. Men. Uh, who's better better at like coping and processing with their emotions, men or women? Um, okay, with well this, I, you know, and some of the other ones I have, it has an asterisk over it, okay? Um, you know, you, you know, you're saying, because I, I, I'm assuming that this would be women, but it does women. have a big asterisk, I, it does have a big asterisk over no. it. No, no, right, because we, be we bad, see, like, extreme, know, like, emotional responses for men. Can I, can I talk? Sure. Okay, so, you know, and then the ashes would be, you know, a lot of times, you know, the world, what does the world tell a lot of men growing up? What, what, you know, a lot of men, you know, you don't, you don't cry. You don't. So a lot of times, you know, men are holding these things in, you know, because at the end of the day, your childhood is like your foundation. Um, 
So that that would that would to me would be the big asterisk of you know men can't you know and men don't feel comfortable with women you know talking to women about these things because you know women do you know you know you can say all these things that women want this and women want that but a lot of times you know a woman doesn't want a man to you know be saying all his feelings because women look for us um, and a, a lot of times you know to be um, a, you know a masculine figure in their life and you know they you know when you look at a man you you. Um, I'm not saying this literally. Um, you look uh, like you, since when have men listened to women? When when did I when did I say that when men listen to women? Can you explain that? Yeah, sure. So you just tried to like blame the social indoctrination of men uh, into like not expressing their emotions on women, right? But obviously no, this no, isn't no, the I, case. No, don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Well, I didn't blame it. Don't, don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. No, no, you quite literally said women want men to be less emotional. And this is like, this is going to be like the case for that, right? Okay. Uh, but obviously yeah, like society, yep. society is ran by men. Uh, men don't typically listen to women. This is evidently clear. You think that men are the necessary leaders of women and of themselves, right? And it's obviously clear that men are more emotional than women because they self and alive more. They you know, abuse substances more. Uh, you oh, know, like violent God. crimes are obviously <laughs> are obviously you know the result of like an emotional fire. And like ninety to ninety five percent of all violent crimes are committed by men. Like all wars and genocides are committed by men. All reckless activities such as drunk driving, reckless driving, and gambling are committed by men. Like our arson, kidnapping, child abuse, animal abuse, uh, domestic violence, uh, cyberbullying with a threat of, uh, of, of violence, like violent extremism, terrorism, mass shootings, school shootings, um, like public unalivings, executions are like vastly, overwhelmingly committed by men, right? So this okay. was that train of thought that I was leading you down. All of these emotional reactions are committed by men to do the violent crimes, the substance abuse, the unaliving. Uh, but then who's better in academics? Uh, women who graduates more from college, more at all levels, women. Like who's better at uh, managing with their emotions? Women. Who's better at coping with their stress? Women. Who's more patient? Women. Who's better at uh, talking to individuals with their people skills? Women. Who volunteers more? Women. Who believes in like collective ideals of like the progression of a society? More men are women. Uh, women. Like, I mean, like, no matter, like, the lens in which you look at it through, like, the empirics would obviously point towards women being, like, more level-headed um, with their wits about them uh, and more, generally more logical and less emotional in that sense. And this is backed uh, by other empirics, such as the fact that we've shown that women uh, possess higher EQs on average than men and also possess higher IQs on average than men. So, okay, I mean, even so if we just, like, boil down all external factors and look at what matters, the EQ and the IQs, thank you for the hanging lights, we see women dominating that as well i mean any way you look at it man it's just it's um it, it's a it's a it's a picture that's being painted here that completely disagrees with okay your so 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 that would mean you know based off what you said and i would you know please let me talk you know because you've been trusting multiple times and then okay so i'm just can you please let me talk so um what i'll ask you is you know if women are so much better than men and you know all this um why don't matriarchs work why, because why men are physically they... stronger okay what okay yeah no that's why, the simple why, answer why, for why that why can't a matriarch work i i just answered you because men are physically stronger so men so you know men are you know they got all these things you know they're more patient you know they they you know you you basically so that's the only category that you think that men are better that's never what I, I said. Whole, I just I just simply said women are less emotional and more logical. And right, okay, like you're asking so why matriarchs don't work. A lot of, it's because like it's because men are physically stronger. And what we've seen you, in our history you, is the barbaric overthrow all right, of who's right. physically stronger. But all if right. you want to talk about this in like a more intellectual society such as the okay. one we live in today, we actually do see women exerting can I, can I uh, say more something? more, can more can able more able ability towards can leadership. I say something? Can I say something? Um, I, I'm like, you know, you, I don't know what to say, um, oh, so, you know, when you put emotions like that, you know, you know, as acts, you know, of, you know, you said unaliving yourself, um, wars and, you know, all of that kind of stuff. Um, I think suicide was also a pretty good example substance abuse was a pretty good example all right, all right. okay so emotion, committing emotional crimes was also a pretty good example okay there's, there's okay. gonna be i mean shit man there's honestly there's gonna be like a lot of good examples okay all right so you said all that okay so when when people say men are more logical than women like you know we don't a lot of times a lot of times men don't think with emotions more times than not 
Um, so why do men, men commit vast majority of like violent crimes, which are an emotional because response? Because as men, as men, as as with every other species, um, you know, you you have testosterone. Um, or and I don't know if I it's did. called testosterone or other cut. And then the, so you know, I did. Um, what'd you say? No, I was just I was just um to who? Yes, yeah, I did. I did have that. Yes, I was just okay. responding to a text I just got. All right, so you know, um, you know, you got testosterone, and you know, do your homework on testosterone, bro. It is, you know, it call it calls you to do some things, like it calls you to, you know, more. You honestly more just kind of be like, you're, you're honestly just kind of like tripping and stumbling over your words at this point, man. Like honestly, you're saying men think without emotion. No, men obviously think with so much emotion because they literally fucking unalive themselves more. I got you. I will. They, they unalive themselves more. This is like the strongest form of like an emotional response, and men do that more, right? No, and like what? Are, what about other forms of this? Like, like the whole violent crime thing. Like, why do we see men getting so pissed off and angry and just committing all these violent crimes if they think with logic and not emotion? Sabrina, thank you for the hand arts. I appreciate it. And I got you. Um. Anyway, oh, so Jamin, there's like there's so many ways to look at this. What if we just like look at the actual tests? What if we just like look at the actual IQ tests? What do you say the IQ is going to be indicative of who has a higher level of logic? Um, I mean, I, what is IQ based on? Like graded off of? It's called I, I it's called the intelligence quota. Yeah, I don't I don't know what is ba based off of. Is it like based off book smarts or what? Like, it's I don't based know what off it's based of logic. It, it is it is a logical test that tests one's recognition and ability to express um you know their innate level of 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 logical of of logical function, right? All right. Well, I think you know we we kind of you know kind of you know shot away from the topic a little bit more. And, We're talking and about women. W women have higher. Okay. So tests okay. Let's so let's say let's say you know let's just you know I don't want to. Okay. You want to skip off? Okay. Well, sure. Well, no, 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 no. I'm gonna say you're right. I'm not gonna skip it. I'm I'm gonna say that let's say you're right on you know all of this. I don't believe that. Um, I don't know how you can grade. Do, you, do know, you want me a source? I, do you want a source? I could send you a source. All right. Yeah, you can do that. But um, but that doesn't take away the fact that. Um, you know, these leadership positions as in, you know, you know, purified water and, you know, things like that. <laughs> Man, <laughs> honestly, l listen, if you think men are superior to women, uh, because like, you know, more men are plumbers, uh, than women fucking run with that delusion. Like, go, go, you, go, go, go wherever you want with that. Go, go that wherever, thing? go, go why wherever you, you want in the, no, listen, don't interrupt me. Go wherever, don't, don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me. Don't interrupt me, j -Man. Know your place, right? I will, come on. Know your place. Know so, my place. So, I will like, beat the fucking... Yeah, so see, no, you're right. This is exactly what I'm talking about. As soon as, like, a man... Like, bro, no, as soon as a man gets can't, shown can't, he's in the wrong, they get all emotional. Like that, no, no, j -Man, This is, like, unironically, you are the you product. Really you are me, the bro. product of the statistics in which in which I am mentioning. You, be, you, you get so be emotional to where you start... You should be more respectful. Okay, so now you get your freeze. No, you are the product of the of the statistics in which I'm like which I aforementioned right you can't handle the truth so then you just say you're gonna beat the fuck out of me like right. unironically that is why 95% of all violent crimes are committed by men and that is exactly why men do think with emotion and have less logic than women like that statement alone counteracts and refutes the points in which you've already made up to this point on a live Right. All right. But anyways, I'm gonna get back to what I was saying. Right. If okay, you think so. that men are superior to women because there's more men plumbers than women, oh. fucking run with that delusion and do whatever you want with it. If that satisfies you in any type of way, fucking do whatever you want with it. Right. But see, right. I'm a man of logic and rationale, and the logic and the rationale completely disagree with that deluded ass worldview. All right. So is it my turn? Yes. All right. So first of all, let's just get this straight. You know, you you don't interrupt me multiple times when I've been in the middle of talking, and you know, and, and it's, it's it's more of a patience thing. You know, I don't have the same patience. You know, women are then, more patient than men too. Women are more patient than men too. That's then, that's also see, like been right empirically now, proven. Right now, what are you doing right now? What are you doing right now? And then when I do it to you, what do you do? Let me talk. Let me know your place. You know, you you know, you're trying to like, you know, like, you know, you know. Put your man lean, you know, your own man, you know, you know, but you're not like that, bro. You're, you're a softie. Okay. So let's just get that out the way. Okay. So, um, you know, you, you, you bow down to women, you know, that's not a bad thing, but you know, it's not, it's not. Absolutely logical. not at all. You're a woman not, can't not tell logical. me what to do. You know, so. A man can't tell me what to do. 
No, I don't. Yeah, I don't bow down to women. But, but, no, <laughs> I'm just no. There's a big difference between being subservient and being logical. And this okay. is like another big misconstruction of you and people like you is the fact that when you see me, a real fucking man, just like observing the world for what it is and discrediting these different notions such as toxic masculinity or narcissism, all of a sudden I'm a beta male who bows down uh, no, to the for, beta, for the forevering gaze of women. Right? I this isn't true beta, in the though. slightest. This isn't. This isn't like true in the slightest. I don't bow down to women. I just certainly don't bow down to this false misconstruction of the alpha male or, or male superiority. That's what I disagree with because the empirics disagree with it. Honestly, if you want to know what I bow down to, it's like so it's 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 rationalism. I bow down to rationalism. I, I bow down to like formulating my beliefs based upon, you know, legitimate forms of science, fact, logic or reason. Right. And so like this has nothing to do with like me like, oh, just wanting some pussy or just like wanting like the female gaze or attention. I no, that, that, I has, I that, that has nothing to do with that, that whatsoever. I didn't say that. That, that sounds like your own insecurity speaking. I didn't say I didn't say that. Um, yeah, it was obviously implied by the whole like you bow down to women thing. That is like so incorrect on so no, many levels. Not, I'm, just not, like, I'm just simply like I'm just simply like I'm just simply like more logical than you. I observe the world for how it is, and the world how it is shows you uh, or shows us that like it. This has nothing uh, to do like the, like uh, what the real world shows us is that this misconstruction of men being more logical and less emotional or this are superior or like better leaders is false. Um. I think you know. Uh, uh, okay, okay. So, can I talk about the the um, trans women thing? I, I, I'll concede. Sure, that. you can pivot to whatever, man. I don't care. Yeah, yeah, I'll fucking. I'll, not, not, I'll, I'll, I'll like. I'll beat you on all bases, dude. If you want, if like, if if yeah, if I mean, if that was it for you on that topic, if you concede, if you want to pivot, fucking pivot. Why are you being so cocky, bro? Why are you being so cocky, bro? I just said, can we switch? Can we? Okay, I said you won. Okay, can we switch? And you're. I'll yeah. beat you. Like, bro, just chill. Yeah, sure. Bro. Go ahead. Go ahead. And, like, calm yeah, down. Yeah. What, what about what about trans women? Calm down. I'm not being cocky. Just, I'm just being realistic. No, you're you're really no, you're really actually being like genuinely cocky, bro. Like, I, no, I I I, 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 I asserted I'll a hypothesis. No, hold on. no, no. I'm just simply following the scientific method. I asserted a hypothesis, <laughs> which is 